Thank you, everyone, for holding. We're now joined with head coach Joey Jones of South Alabama. If you have a question for Coach Jones, please press star 1 at this time to get in the queue to ask questions. Uh, coach Jones, before we get to question, p- questions, please give us your thoughts on the last game against Georgia Southern and the upcoming game against Appalachian State. Yeah, obviously we played a very good football team, Georgia Southern. Um, um, they did a, did a great job, and uh, uh, congrats to them. And then as far as Appalachian State, um, uh, you know, we got another team that's uh, very good, uh, ranked high in the conference, got a great record, um, and very much improved team over last year. Thank you very much, Coach Jones. Our first questions come from Steve Barrow. Steve, please go ahead. Hey, Coach. Uh, this is Steve Barrow hey. calling from the Watauga Democrat in Boone. Um, yeah. Have you got a plan somehow to attack this defense? They seem to be play- having a pretty good year this year. You got any ideas? <laughs> uh, I they they probably wouldn't talk to me anymore if I did. Uh, <laughs> yeah, they're good. Uh, but you know they're much improved, uh, you know, especially up front, uh, and um, they really uh, are playing well right now. And um, um, you know, really not a lot of weaknesses. You always try to find that golden nugget. You know, when you find a weakness somewhere and. Um, they don't really seem to have many. They seem that their, their speed seems to really be the thing that is getting to teams. So they, you might be able to break or create a running lane, and all of a sudden the linebackers seem to fill the gap. Is that kind of part of what their success is based on? It is part of it for sure. I, I think they're dynamic up front. They're quick. You know, not the. Of course, the inside guys are big, but you know their ends are very athletic, dynamic guys. And um, and uh, the law kid linebackers uh, uh, can really run, like you say, uh, and get to the footballs. So, yeah, they got overall really good team speed. Um, uh, offensively, uh, you kind of talk about the running game. Now they got two guys that seem to have the hot hand in Cox and Moore. Yeah, um, they're uh, they're very good. What they do, the stretch play is obvious. Uh, their main uh, running football play, and they do a great job of blocking that. Very well coached on the offensive line. Uh, I've got uh, better people up front uh, than last year, and uh, they do a great job with, with that stretch play especially. Uh, last year, did, uh, did you kind of, I guess, give them their first Sun Belt moment? Just, um, they, you, you seem to just overwhelm them, especially with your team speed. Yeah, we you know we were a pretty good team last year, and um, we we had a good game. I thought we played our quarterback played real well against them. I thought defensively we played tremendous too, you know. And and uh, you know we were we were at that point we were playing really good football, and uh, I think we just uh, you know just had a good game against them, and, and uh, so but we knew they were a very good team. But I think we probably played um, we were kind of top of our game during that time. Um. That's all I had. Thanks, Coach. Thank you. Thank you very much, Steve, and thank you, Coach Jones. That's all the questions we have for today. We appreciate your time. Okay, buddy. See you. Bye.